high structure water. Oh, cool. So I put the marbles here and some uh, crystals, right? Yeah. And uh, I put the straw there so it could get these marbles stuck in there. They don't go anywhere. And then I played with it with these mason jars and we tasted the water. It was restructured. It tasted amazing. So now we're going to do, we're going to put this in here and it happens to fit right in precisely. And I'm dumping the big three gallon of water in here. And it, of course, all the water's wrapping around the marbles, right? Creating those molecules to become rounded again and oxygenating the water. And then we're gonna add, add a uh, you know, little, little bit of what, what about one teaspoon, you said? Of, uh, teaspoon. Less than a teaspoon of uh, Himalayan yeah, salt they... to add the, mineral, the minerals to mineralize it again. And voila, we have our little vortex. So this is the vortex. Plus I get a farmer's workout. Okay, so here's what I did. After I restructured the water, I went ahead and put some Himalayan salt. You have to use a wood stick like this one, and you turn it counterclockwise one time, and then you go clockwise, okay? That helps that vortex to continue when you add the minerals, which is, this is the minerals that are missing in water when you do reverse osmosis. So after reverse osmosis water, uh, you want to put a little bit, you know, a hint of uh, salt in there. We use a teaspoon, right, Seth? So then, what I did first before putting it in here, in this container, I actually dumped it in two of these back and forth, three times, three times, and then I put it in here the fourth time, of course, with, once again, the these, uh, I have some marbles in here, and then I have some uh, crystals in here, okay? So when I mix them up in here, I just put this straw here to, to, to clog it in there and make sure the water goes around the rocks or the, I mean the marbles around and through to, to restructure the molecules. That's what I did. Okay, so that's it. And it's in here. And then we did the taste test. Lisa and I, we tried the regular alkaline water and it was a little bit acidic. And then we went ahead and did the, uh, the structured water. And boy, oh boy, let me tell you, Oh my God, it's so, it's soft, it's it's clear, it's it's just like it melts in your mouth. It's really, it's amazing water. So that, that little acidic uh, taste that you have with the regular water, it's totally gone, totally restructured. You could tell, just, just try it, you could tell.